how to set up PS5 Twitch streaming with a MacBook. Okay, is it easy? We can answer that, you know, at the end of the video. All right. This is if you want to do it like the fancy way and not just like click the streaming button Twitch on the PS5 because you know PS5 has like a Twitch thing linked to it already. So need a PS5. Need a MacBook. I got a MacBook Big Sur. Okay, it's the newest one. It's nice. Okay, you need a Logitech webcam. That's what I got. All right, that works. All right. Need a Elgato. I got a HD 60 S Plus. All right, that works. All right. You need a mic stand. Check it out. Mic stand. You need a mic. You need a. You need a little boombox. Okay. You can see, this is the setup I got. There that is. There's that. There's the mic. The thing. They didn't tell me this with the Elgato it wasn't working you know why because I didn't have a fancy cord you need a fancy cord that can process all the fancy information all right so you got all this stuff right the next step is you get a twitch make a twitch account you have to do the double authentication all right then you get your twitch streaming code then you download OBS okay it's easy stuff then you got to download all the software so for my focus right I had to download focus right control for the Elgato you have to download game capture HD you don't ever have to use it but you need it all right just so it's there turn on the PS5 this is gonna help you gonna set it all up Alright, here's your, P here's your PS5, right? Destiny, whatever. Pretty good game, right? That's the real boy. First step, you gotta go into here, go into your systems. You gotta disable this. And that's so you can stream stuff, but it's also so you can't use, this is what they don't tell you, now you can't go to YouTube or Netflix or any of that shit because they don't want you streaming that stuff. So that's the real lame thing because every single time you want to stream something, you're going to have to unplug everything, re-enable that. Because if you have that enabled, that's not going to work. This ain't going to work. All right. So now that we got that disabled. HDMI plug into the PS5, right? Now it's done. Plug this into the end, where it also the cord is that you plug into your computer. Get it? Now you plug the HDMI from the out into the computer or into the TV. Now, this isn't gonna work just like that. Like I said, I was using a bunch of different types of cords and they weren't working. It's pissing me off. It's because you gotta have a super strong cord. Okay, so make sure you, you don't spend your money on cords like I did when you need the super strong cord. That should start turning on. You see, it's get some light in it. There she goes. So we have the Elgato hooked up. That's the first step. The Elgato is working just fine. Now I noticed, there's another thing they don't tell you. Oh, shut the fuck up. Another thing they don't tell you is that when I played Call of Duty, it went gray. Everything went super gray. And that's because Call of Duty is weird. And when I went to a different game, it went nice and saturated again. So what I did was screen and video and I had to get my 4k down and my HDR off if you don't do that it's gonna fuck up if you play Call of Duty specifically okay if you don't have a 4k TV okay the next step is the mic which is
kind of harder okay you set all this up it doesn't come like this you gotta set it all up screw it in all right screw it in screw it in get a nice stand whatever you plug that into the jack okay because i don't know anything about mics but once i figure it out it's easy okay plug it into the jack you plug this nice c port into your other jack or whatever so now it's on you push this button to give it some power give it some juice and uh that's basically it so now you got all your stuff set up right and there it is moving up and down as i talk so now i got all that stuff and when you're in here you'll also have your mic and that makes it sound like shit so make sure you turn that all the way down and then once you've been in your settings you've linked your streaming stuff right all you have to do is uh start streaming look at that we're live Look, and there we are. We are live. You know, we've been on for less than a minute. We are live. We've been on for less than a minute. We are live. I got one follower. That's cool. So, the next step is getting people to actually watch you and give a fuck about what you're doing. Uh, that's uh, the next video. If I don't sell all of this stuff uh, to make my money back. Because you have to have at least like two th two k two thousand dollars for all this stuff it's expensive stuff okay around two thousand dollars or more uh, depending on your setup if you have any questions leave it in the comment hopefully I answered all the questions or the main stuff because there aren't any really good tutorials out there that just tells you everything you need to do uh, basically just shows you everything you need to do you just need to download the softwares OBS is the main thing that people use but like I tried to use my Focusrite plugged it in it wasn't working all I had to do was just go to Focusrite download what's it called Focusrite control and then it works right so stuff like that you know if it's not working make sure you have the software in you gotta have your game capture HD for the HD 60 Elgato, right? Once you have all that stuff in, you just put the sources in. You got your game capture from your TV. You got your game capture from your HD camera. You got your audio from this mic, you know? A little too loud. Sorry. Uh. And then you're basically good to go. You just uh, start streaming. I'm gonna stop streaming now because I'm still live. So you wanna make sure you get your good cords. The cord I have is a fucking 5A, 10 G B P S cord. All right, look that up. That one works. Would I do this again? I don't know. I streamed. Obviously, no one watched because you gotta have to follow on. But that's not really the point. You know, the point is streaming for fun. You know, you capture cool gameplay, you get your reaction, and then you can just post it on the internet. That's what I thought it'd be, you know. I stream, capture the gameplay, post it, make a YouTube channel, post it on there. People don't have to watch it, but as long as you keep on posting, someone's going to watch eventually, right? The main issue for me was that it's just such a setup. Like, you, you have to tear everything that, like, you know, I want to play games. When I'm done playing, I can stop streaming and fucking turn on YouTube and watch something. Or I can be playing games, take a break, eat something, watch some YouTube on my TV, and go right back in. But it's kind of a hassle because you have to undo that thing, undo that thing when it came to the HDMI settings, right? You got to do that every time if you want to watch something on your TV. You also have to, if you don't want to have your computer hooked up 24-7, you have to undo your Elgato every time because the Elgato needs to have the computer hooked up for it to work, right? It can't just work by itself, you know? And so you have to have basically this whole setup I showed you all the time, 24-7. Uh, I'm curious if just streaming with the option the PS5 gives you 
straight to Twitch. And if you really like gameplay, the new PS5 has a great capture. This one gives you a bunch of time. It gives you a whole hour if you want. Uh, and you can really specify like what you want. Like, oh yeah, I want this amount of time. That might I only want five seconds. You know, you can say that. And uh, I assume if you just hook a webcam up to your PS5, then you can bypass all this stuff. So I don't know if it was really worth it in the end. Make sure you like and share the video. And uh, this is just up here forever to hopefully help out uh, PS5 users with Macs. This process for me took about a week and a half to figure all the way out. So it definitely took a while. Uh, the main problem for me was my Elgato. I didn't have the right cords for it. And so it wasn't, the Elgato just wasn't capturing. You know, it was kind of annoying. Oh, my shield, baby. What are you doing, number two? Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> All right, let's put the mic audio back up. Ugh. I got your back up. What's the difference, son? Huh? What's the difference, bitch? Ah, look at you. <laughs> Not looking good at all. That worked for me was a, a 5A 10 60 GB. Uh, S, 1060, bitch, the cord that worked for me was 5A10 gigabyte, or, it's a 5A10 GB, GB, okay, 